Elcraft KX3 fitting the KX80 3 um, internal antenna tuner. Uh, usual dismo. Undo. Loosen that. Loosen that. Loosen that. Loosen that. Uh, this is going to be a bit awkward, one handed, but that's better with me. Not the easiest thing in the world to do, one handed. Okay, normally you know, obviously take all the batteries out. I've actually fitted the board. I'm just going to show you quickly how it's done. Ah, this just gives the, the lighting conditions. Um, basically, the board is held in with this screw and this screw. That's the antenna lead that comes up. Now, that's normally plugged into the bottom board. Just disconnect that, lift it over. I would recommend that you sort of push that in part way and then obviously line the board up. There's pins here that have to line up and there's some pins there that have to line up. Push the board down, tighten your screws, make sure that's connected. It doesn't matter which way round, both of those are to the center pin of the BNC socket. So you can insert that any way which round you like. Obviously, normally you wouldn't be doing it with all the batteries in and things. Uh, once that's done, let's just close him back up again. Turn him on. Go into your menu by holding the disc for at least three seconds. Rotate. Sorry. Rotate. Do you come past it? Hang on. There. ATUMD. Probably be set to bypass that or not in use. Switch. To auto. Press the menu OK. You exit. Power off. And we're done. Uh, let's uh, tighten everything up. Put your batteries back in before I've probably doing all this. But yeah, uh, just bought this. Just dropped the module in. Don't know a lot about the radio yet. So as I want to find a little bit more, I might post a bit more. Uh, thanks for watching. 73s.